Greetings, everybody. I'm Aaron Kisharski. There's Kiwi, Joshi over there setting up. And this is Retro Palooza Dallas. Woo. Look who showed up, Steve. Uh, what did you pick up? I just picked up this. We made a nice even trade at a booth. Wow, how much was that? Uh, this was 800, but I got it for like a really good deal. He, got, he took a couple hundred off. And ba back, when I, stuff. back when I had my 64 set, that was one of the only two boxes I didn't have. Yeah, it's really clean. I'm pumped. Wow. He gave me a really good deal, so. So, just did my first trade of the con. I got a Game Boy Advance. And what's your name? Uh, my name is Thurston, and I got uh, two 8 bit. Yeah, he got two of the 8 bit Perlers. Uh, I have a guy that makes those. We call him Perler Man. So, John, look at that. First sale of the day. Scream is oh, here. Yeah. Scream is here at the booth. And what did you just pick up, Josh? Uh, mystery bag of shirts. What's in a box, man? I know so. As, as RGT would say. To get okay, hold on. I'll wait till you open it. Whoa, what, what, what the hell? I just bought 30 N64 games. How much? <laughs> uh, we made a deal. I got it down from 900 to 200. Wow. How, how did you get from 900 out of 200? I can't. I, I, I traded and I found wow. some games in that dollar box. So Steve's over there trying to uh, make deals on uh, some bin stuff. That guy sells the stupid cheap. I'm walking around the con. This is my first chance to get to walk around and see things. I'll let you guys know if I find anything. Uh, I'll see you guys back at my booth. What the hell just walked by my booth? It's a guy on stilts. Josh just took a picture of him. And Steve's over there uh, barraging through games. Hey, mother, what took you so long to get here? I was being lazy. She was in the hotel all morning. Look at this. Packed booth. My booth's been packed all morning. Money's is flowing in. Okay, everybody, we're here. Uh, I, that's the only thing I'm missing on it. Yeah, I'm over $500 so far for the day. Um, Josh is over here eating his little nachos. I'll keep you guys updated. The booth has been packed nonstop all day. I'll see you guys in a second. If anything cool happens, I'll let you know. Ooga booga! So true. Dang it. I tried to scare you, it didn't work. So See, Mama K can work. She knows how to work. She just, oh, uh... stop it. <laughs> oh, look, she's, she's got her little cutie polar pop. Thanks, Mama K. And we'll see you guys later. Whoa. I just traded Steve all the perlers for a bunch of empty um, boxes. Oh, I don't know. I don't think I do. You can go look. Look at all that. And then look over there. The man, the myth, the legend. Boogie2988. Woo. Okay, guys, Josh is over there on the phone. Um, so I'm at about a G, but we're about to pack up. We're closing in like 5 10 minutes for today. Uh, so this concludes day one of the con. We're gonna try this all again tomorrow. Um, I don't know. It's not been a horrible day, but I'm probably not gonna make quite what I was intending on making. We'll find out tomorrow. So I'll keep you guys posted and I'll let you know. Whoa. Look. Look, it's Luigi and Toad. T um, this is day two of the con. We're setting everything up. Uh, VIPs just got in. Pretty soon they're gonna open the floodgates. This is gonna be crazy. So stay tuned, this is day two. There's a flea market episode at the con. Josh, say hi to everybody. Josh. Kiwi, I need you to make me some money today. Make money. I don't know if I did this yesterday or not. If not, I'm doing it today. Um, so here's the little shirt, the shirt then. Um, VHS tapes, R.L. Stein, Goosebumps. We got all the Halloweenies. Then over here we have 
the Watch Dogs 2s. We got some systems, PS2, some Xbox Ones, 360s, Super Nintendo, 64s, all the goodies. Over here we got Switch Corner with some Wii's. We got all the good Switch games, Mario's, we got the Pokemon's, the Zeldies, Xbox Ones, Sega Genesis. Over here we got Beauty and the Beast, Donkey Kong, Mario World, some Sega games, some Super Nintendo, 64, some gold controllers. Um, I sold the Power Glove yesterday for $120, so that was cool. But yeah, we got the Miracle Piano. We've got a bunch of GameCube games. I don't usually have a stack of those, but I do this time. We've got all this. We got an empty cup. We got some Xbox games, and we also have a Kiwi. So my brother just sold me 21 Sport GameCube games, uh, $60. Which you're probably like, why are you buying sport games? Why are you paying two, three dollars? Well, because I gave him thirty dollars credit towards his trip to get here, and then thirty cash. So really, I only gave him thirty cash. But otherwise, sixty. The reason why I did so high on them is because I sell the cases on eBay. I've been getting twelve dollars a case, eleven ninety nine or eleven ninety five a case, free, free shipping. So it ends up being like eight dollars is what I end up getting after you know fees and then the shipping cost but still so the case alone was worth paying two two fifty to three dollars I guess each and then oh look here's Steve Woo! Woo! <laughs> so there's there's Josh's buddy is Francis is Francis Francis is here the boogie two nine to the eight eight you should go say hi Josh he loves you there is my booth. It is day two. We are packed. I actually just sold. I just sold the Jeffrey um, for ten dollars. So all of you guys that said, "Oh, I wasn't going to sell Jeffreys," I sold one. I gotta go. I gotta go put another one up there. So anyway, I'll see you guys later at the con. And go Jeffrey. Go Toys R Us. I don't want to grow up because I'm a Toys R Us kid. Just made a sale. Steve's over there. I just sold that one dude over there. Um, a bunch of my empty box 64 games. Um, it was just boxes and manuals mostly. Anyway, give me a good deal. Uh, $200 sale. So that was the biggest one sale I've made so far at the con. Saved my day for today because today was starting off to be a little, a little on the weak side. But uh, there's still much more to the day. We got another six hours left, so. I'll keep you guys posted, and I will see you later at the con. Look at that, there is an alien here today. Oh, look at that. oh that's so cool. That is so cool. That is so cool. Um, another $55 sale. Money is trickling in. Kind of slow, but it is what it is. Where have you been all morning? I went to Walmart. My sandwich better not be cold. Well, it has no choice to be cold. It's a long walk and ride over my purse. Josh. Yeah, apparently she went. She went to Walmart and got food. So I'm gonna go eat. So I just sold. So Adam is buying this official Nintendo's player guide from this gentleman. Woo! Video game. Video game wizard. Video game wizard, everybody. He's filming me while I'm filming him, film section. And uh, Adam made an offer for a cold $20 bill. $20, $20 bill. In $20. This is a little man. Put that in my game. hand. Woo! Over 90 NES games. And it's. Wah! I'm going with that bitch. Got him. Josh, what did you pick up? A bunch of creative comics. Creative comics. Stop buying stuff. We're here to make money, not spend money. Josh, nobody wants your trash turtle books. We don't care that they're graded. We don't care that you might think they're autographed because they aren't. We don't want them. Do, 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 do. Look at it. Even Sonic shops at Video Game Wizard. We are wrapping things up here at the con. He was here. Um, so I did almost. Almost three. Almost three. Ah. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say, almost three. And ob obviously I mean big boy threes, not little boy threes. But anywho, um, yeah, I need to find, where'd Mama K go? I need to find Mama K, cause I gotta get the question of the day. Let me go see if I can find her and I'll be right back. 
So by now it's no big secret that the people that host Retropools Dallas are doing um, SoCal Retro Gaming Expo in California um, next year. It's April 1st and 2nd. So this will be the question of the day. Mama K went to the, back up to the room, so I wasn't able to get her for the question. So here's my question to you guys. Do you think I should go to the SoCal Retro Gaming Expo next April? Um, I should make more money than I made here today because it's uh, California. Anyway, so let me know in the comments below. Um, do you think I should go to SoCal Retro Gaming Expo, yes or no? Comment, like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time for another wonderful episode. Look at this, look at this, guys. Everybody's packing up. It's Dallas. It's Palooza. I'll see you guys next week. I'm out. Woo! Wow, we're blurry. We're blurry. Hold on. Another retro palooza in the trenches. It's the end of the day. I'm out. I'll see you guys next time we go to Dallas. Woo. Video game is a Okay, wizard.